Hello, Kyler? Yep. Can you hear me okay? Yeah. All right, we will open it up for questions. All right. Kyler? I'm sorry. Sorry, I can't really hear. Okay, they're just wondering, what was your reaction to uh, being drafted? Uh, I mean, it was obviously a lot of excitement. Um, you know, as soon as I felt my, my phone vibrate, I uh, looked over at my wife, and it's her job to, to call her agent. Um, so she did that, and I was taking the phone call, and I um, you know, it was very emotional. And we're both just very, very excited to be um, Packers. Uh, Delaney's reaction there to you being drafted that we heard? No, she's uh, she fell out of her bed. She was taking a little nap when I got drafted, actually. So she's uh, woke up a little on the wrong side. Kyler, did you think that this day would be possible two years ago when you missed basically all of 2014 with the knee injury? Uh, I mean, absolutely. I knew it was possible. Um, you know, it was still my goal. Um, you know, the injury wasn't what I had planned, what we had planned, but in a lot of ways, it, it helped me, I think. Um, you know, it was a blessing in disguise for our family, um, and so we're just grateful to be here right now and to, again, be a part of the Packers organization. How was it a blessing in disguise? Um, so uh, my wife is actually pregnant um, when that happened with, with our daughter, and she actually had a pretty rough pregnancy. Um, she was sick a lot of the time, and I got to spend, once our daughter was born, um, if I had been going through, you know, uh, the whole process of training and preparing for the combine and everything, um, I really wouldn't have been able to have very much time with her when she was first born. And so in those ways, you know, just being able to be there for my wife through the pregnancy and support her and being able to spend a lot of time with my daughter, um, you know, it was, it was kind of a good thing. Yeah. yeah, it's, I mean, it's a huge honor. And those are guys that I'm absolutely looking forward to learning from. Um, you know, there, there are a lot of great players. I mean, it's a great team. I'm so excited to be there and, again, to learn and to contribute everything that I can. Uh, I guess you want to improve everywhere, but what are the places right. that you see the, the most improvement that needs to be made? Um, I think definitely upper body strength is something that I continue to work on. You know, I think I could put on maybe 10 pounds, um, which will help just to be a little more stout in the run game. Um, you know, continuing to work on pass rushing because it is, I think, where I have the most upside, but it is also where I have the most to improve. Um, and, and obviously, Green Bay is a great place to go to learn from the guys that are in front of me. I'm sure you would have gone anywhere, but is it nice to come to a team that plays a 3 4 defense? There's some familiarity there for you? Yeah, absolutely. You know, it is, it is what I'm familiar with. And, um, you know, it's, it's just such an incredible opportunity. Green Bay, um, the town, from what I hear, is my speed, you know, our speed as a family. So. We're very excited. Kyler, how strong did you feel on the knee last year in your first season back? And do you feel like you'll be even stronger maybe in 2016? Did I feel the knee for what? How strong did you feel in your knee last season? And do you feel oh. you'll even be in stronger this year? Yeah. No, it was, um, you know, going into the this last year, it was, I mean, it felt great, but I just hadn't tested it. I hadn't been in contact, you know, since it had happened, obviously. And so I was anticipating that, and it actually was very strong. I wore a brace for about two practice days, and I couldn't, I didn't like it, and it felt secure. So I took that off, and, uh, you know, it did. It felt, it got stronger as the season went on, and, um, you know, I feel, I felt 100% then, but it just continues you know, my legs and getting everything back. Um, it feels great, and I look forward to this next year. Tyler, as you 
kind of touched on a little bit <coughs> everything your wife had been through, everything you'd been through on the field. Uh, how gratifying was this night for you guys being able to uh, you know, make this, this, come, this kind of dream come true? It's, I mean, it really is incredible, you know, and to be able to share it with my wife and, you know, it's just such a huge blessing for us. Um, we're so grateful to be here and I look forward to making the most of this opportunity. Tyler, what, um, what was it like to have Nick go with the pick right before you? Were you guys texting back and forth or anything? I don't know how good of friends you guys are for being teammates, but that, that seems a little wild. Yeah, no, I mean, we're pretty pretty close. We weren't texting during the draft, um, but I actually was on the phone call um, lot when I saw that he got picked, and, you know, I looked at my wife, and we were both really excited for him. I've, I've texted him and, you know, just said congrats. He said the same. So, you know, I mean, it's, it is kind of funny that we went 88 and 89, um, but we're I'm definitely very excited for him, and I think he's the same for me. I mean, I think that's one of the first things that people look for, you know, um, and, and the length and then just kind of being able to keep offensive tackles hands off you. Um, and then, you know, the speed around the edge is something also that I, that I need to continue to work on, but I think is a big upside for me as well. Yeah, what kind of pass rusher are you? Are, are you a speed guy, a power guy? I mean, how do, how do you get to the quarterback? Yeah, I think speed first and foremost. Um, you know, speed kills, and that's why I always try and win with speed first. Um, but then I think, you know, I need to be able to incorporate those power moves and, and counter moves, and that's where I think upper body strength and getting a little bit of weight is going to help. Were you recruited by Gary Anderson? Yes, sir. Anything else for Kyler? Thank you, Kyler. All right, thank you.